Hi guys, my name is Rocky from the Media Stock, and now let's see how to use this transition zone, transition pack for Premiere Pro. All right, now I'm inside of Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2018. So make sure you have CC 2018 to use this pack. Otherwise, the previous version will not work here. So in this project window, you need to first import the transition pack. So click on right click and click in this import, and then just navigate to this transition zone project file and hit open and here's the important thing just select this um, just select this import entire project and this one is important just click this allow import duplicate medias right so keep in mind these two things need to be checked hit ok there it is you have this transition pack now let's open this they will find two folders here one transition and one this assets folder there is nothing in this assets folder to change so just ignore this so let's open this transition folder and there we can see this six resolution is available for now the first one is 1080 into 1080p for facebook or instagram videos square videos the second one is 1080 into 1920p which is the vertical version and third one is 1280 into 720p which is standard 16 is to 9 ratio resolution and the fourth one is uh, 2048 into 858 which is a scope cinematic scope res transition resolution and fifth one is the 4k version 3840 into 2160 right and the last one is the standard full hd which is 1920 into 1080p so make sure to use the proper resolution in your proper sequence right so my my sequence is now 1920 into 1080p so i'm going to use this so i'm going to double click on this transition folder to open this in a new bin Right now you can see there is 10 different categories here just choose any categories you want and select and double click on this folder icon to open this in a new bin again so make sure to click on this icon view to display all of this thumbnail now you can just hover over any thumbnail to display the animation before applying any of this transition make sure to turn off this insert and override sequence icon here and deselect this video on track right not this track but the left side track if it's deselected then it's okay and if it's selected then make sure to deselect this one it's kind of important all right all right now just um, choose any of this transition you like and just drag and drop in between of two clips and there we have it in this step you can just apply any of this transition you like just drag and drop in the timeline and it's done so that's basically it how to use this transition zone pack just by dragging and dropping the transition into your timeline hope this video helped if you have any questions feel free to email me i will be happy to assist you